AG Squad. Welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? Today's episode, we have this cool arms right here and pretty much what this is, is a kilowatt meter. So literally what this product is, is a monitor or tester to test like the kilowatts or the watts that you're using when you guys are using electricity. If you can see for the one that we got right here from this brand, and here the name of the product. If you guys turn to the back, they do provide some specs and features about the product. But first, I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the inside looks like. So when I do open up, here's what the inside looks like. Let's take it out. So once you guys do take it out, in the very bottom, there's more stuff. Let me show you guys what else is included. So at the very bottom, they do probably guys a user manual to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. And also at the bottom, they do probably this cable that you can use. If you guys do unplug it, here's what the cable looks like. So I'm assuming you guys can use it as a standard cable to extend the product if you guys do need to, which is pretty nice. And that is everything that's included in the package. Now I'll show you the actual product. So here is the back of the product. It is three prong, which is grounded. And right here is what the front part looks like. So we do have the brand name. We do have the plug outlet. We do have the display screen. We do have a few buttons for the press. Up, down, set, and OK. They mentioned the max on here is 16A when you guys do use it. And when you guys do feel the overweight of the product, it's not that heavy, which is pretty nice. So that is everything that's on the product. Let me test it out to show you guys how it works. So this test, I'm gonna use extender option. And we'll plug the other side to my power strip. So the power strip that I do have right here is from U Green brand that has like the USB option and USB-C option. And they give you guys a two prong option and two of the three prong option on the back. And also have a button for the turn on and turn off when you guys are not using it, which is really convenient. And the side of the part is actually very small and compact if you can see. So if you guys are interested in this one, feel free to check it out. But let's plug it in to test it out to show you guys what it actually looks like and how it does work. So I'm plugging the back. Once you guys plug it in, here's what the screen looks like. And for this test, we're going to use this U Green wall charger that has the USB option and USB-C option. And the max power that it supports on here is 140 watts. And it does have a very nice photo plug. That's actually very compact and very space saving if it's seen. So that way when you guys are not using it, you guys can push back up. Just like that. And when you guys do purchase this, it does give you guys a cable for it to use. That's supposed to support up to 240 watts when you guys do use it, which is really nice. And the material that's on this cable is very high quality. It is nylon braided. And then here's what the cable looks like in this side. So it is USB-C to USB-C. So now let's plug everything in to test it out to show you guys how well it does work. And how much power is being charged from a MacBook Pro, which is right here. So this is the MacBook Pro 16 inch. So I'm gonna plug in one end right here first. The other end I'm gonna plug in right here. So I do wanna plug in the bottom one right here because it does support 140 watts whereas the other one only supports 100 watts. So I do plug it in, and I want to open it up. And what I want to do is plug it in right here. Once you guys do plug it in, it does show you the power that's being generated on here. So right now, providing 101 watts. And the battery percentage that's on my laptop right now is 44%. So it does charge pretty fast, but it's not as fast as what it does mention for 140 watts. But we see when we do use the product, it definitely does work. And it does show you guys how much power that's being generated on here. If you guys press on this button right here, It show you guys other measurement on here if you guys are interested. So I can see the product definitely does work and it's very easy for it to use it. Literally all you need to do is plug it in and it show you guys the measurement on here in terms of how much power that's being generated. And feel free to change the setting on here in terms of what you guys want to see as well. But that is everything that's all in the product. Now to come boxing and test the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these. Especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality tester to test like the current or the kilowatt that's being charged or used when you guys are charging your laptop, refrigerator, or anything else to keep track of how many electricity you guys are using, then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. <laughs> but then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.